Hello, welcome to Carrot Seat's first iPod Touch videos. Um, thanks for watching. I'm gonna start off with um how to jailbreak an iP iPod Touch or iPhone. This will work for the first gen and second generation. I'm not so sure about the third generation. Um, you will need to have the firmware 3.12, and if you don't have that, you're gonna need a downgrade. Or if you have something lower, you're gonna need an upgrade. Just never download a 3.13 because that'll just make it harder once you have it. Okay, so to figure out what kind you have, go to settings, go to general, go to about, and then scroll down until you see version. Mine says 3.12, so that's the correct thing. <coughs> so then, if you don't have uh, the correct versions, um, you go to flexiburns.de iPod firmware. <coughs> And what you're going to need to do is select your um, type of iPod or iPod, iPhone or iPod Touch. So scroll down to whatever iPhones up here. If you're going to upgrade or downgrade from an iPhone, you'll click this one, iPhone 3.12. If you're going for an iPod Touch, click your generation. Mine is 2G and hit 2G 3.12. Then you hit download and it will take you to megaupload.com. <clears throat> and so after you do that, you will get hold on. You will get something that looks like this. It will take about 50 to 30 minutes to download. And so um as soon as you do that, you'll need to go to iTunes, your device. This is my brother, so I know it's named Alan. Uh, oops. Hit shift, it doesn't matter left or right, shift, and hit restore. This will come up with the um, option to choose where you want to find it. So click here and click that and hit open. But warning, as soon as you do that, it will restore it and it will go back to factory settings. So you'll lose pretty much everything you had on their app, songs, and all that crap. Okay, so <clears throat> as soon as you did that, you'll need to go to blackrain.com. Blackrain is what it makes the easiest jailbreak ever. Ever. Okay, so you'll see this dude's face here. And if you're a Mac user, click this. If you're a Windows user, hit that. It'll take like two to three seconds to download. And it should look like this right here. And so what Black Rain basically does, it hacks your iPod Touch so <coughs> it can get this on here. Oops. You can get Black Rain on here. And from Black Rain, you can get Sydney or Rock. And then this is just to uninstall it here. I use Sydney. I don't have rock at all. See Sydney. And that's how you get custom themes and stuff like the keyboard. I'll make a video on how to get a keyboard cuz winterboard doesn't work. <coughs> okay, so um let's see. As soon as you get Black Rain, I'll just show you guys. <coughs> Let it shut down. Okay. Oh, and also, if you ever shut down your device, uh, this will happen. You, this will come up, and then it'll say you'll you'll need a restore. Just ignore that. You don't need to. Just every time you shut it off or it runs out of battery, you have to hit black rain. And so, as soon as you do that, it'll say make it rain. Click it. If you have Mac, it'll say make it snow. And then this will come up. If you do not see, um, if you don't see the guy's face on here with all the iPod touches and stuff, just shut it down and then restart it and then hit m and make it rain again. Or you probably have the wrong firmware. And so this will take like, I don't know, a couple of seconds. So see, your jailbreak is done. And w once the device reboots for Tetherhead run again, it was the simplest jailbreak ever. <coughs> okay. And so remember. That's the only one con. If you shut it down, 
it, you'll have to make it rain again. So do not delete black rain. And again, the links will be up in the description. Okay. Let Geotech load up. Okay, there we go. And so as soon as you have that, you'll get black rain or red snow. Okay, and so just go to Sydney. And I already have it pre installed, so I'll just say install and whatnot. And so this is my video on how to make how uh, one of the easiest jailbreaks ever. So leave a comment, see if you liked it, uh, did it help you or not. And yeah, thanks for watching.